These are the best racing games coming in 2024. Let's start with Assetto Corsa 2. We can expect early access in the summer of 2024, PC first and hopefully it will be released this year. I think the graphics will get a major upgrade and it will look amazing. For multiplayer we need a good netcode but also the availability to do driver swaps and a good competitive system would be great so we can just keep on racing with a nice safety rating and competitive people to race against on the same level. Of course modding is a big thing in Assetto Corsa at the moment and I hope to see more of that and even better in Assetto Corsa 2. I hope that the developers work with modders together to make a featured page with approved mods that you can easily select and implement in the game so you can try it out yourself and maybe like the best rankings and the best cars and whatever the options are unlimited and I hope to see more of it. Next up, we can expect the Assetto Corsa Competizione GT2 pack that it's coming in January. So it's uh, pretty soon. These are the seven cars that you can expect. The Lamborghini Huracan, Audi R8, Mercedes AMG GT, the KTM Expo GTX, Maserati MC20 and the Porsche 911 GT2. The GT2 cars will have more power and less downforce, so they will be amazing to drive and I cannot wait to try them out. Besides the GT2 pack, we can also expect the Nordschleife to be added in spring of 2024 and this will be incredible for multi-class races and I really want to try it out because the Green Hell is the best racetrack on the world. Le Mans Ultimate will be released on PC on the 20th of February. This will be the official sim racing game for the 24 hour of Le Mans and the FIA World Endurance Championship. It looks like R Factor 2 but with much user friendlier menus and you can easily navigate through it. Hopefully it will be also easier to calibrate your hardware and tweak it so you get the best wheel feeling that you can ever have. The tracks will be laser scanned and you can expect these tracks. Sabring, Portimao, Spa, Le Mans, Monza, Fuji and Sakir. These are some great tracks but what cars can you expect? Of course you can expect the Le Mans hypercar and Le Mans Daytona class cars but also the GTE cars like Aston Martin, Corvette, Ferrari and Porsche and LMP2 cars will be available. You can definitely expect the Ferrari 488 GTE Evo the Peugeot 9X8, the Porsche 963 LMDH and the Toyota GR010. I'm looking forward to give it a try. What do you expect of this game? Next up, we can expect Rensport in 2024 or at least still the beta. I've been to one of the ESL R1 competitions that's running on Rensport and it's a great opportunity for the drivers and I hope to see more of it of course in the future. But the game is not finished, it's not ready, it got a little bit of mixed reviews so I don't know exactly what to expect but what do you think that Rensport will be? Will it be great or will it be decent? Let me know in the comments. I hope to see that the game will be finished and ready to be released instead of all these updates in the beta because I think we're ready for a proper launch. iRacing is coming with a weather update so you can expect rain and mixed weather coming in 2024. They don't know when but it should be coming pretty soon. Probably later this year GT Revival is coming in the holidays of 2024 so you can expect it at the end of the year and this will be a bit like Project Cars 1 and 2, so a bit of uh, nostalgia. Test Drive Unlimited Solar Crown is coming early in 2024 and this is an open world racing game, so I can't wait to give it a try. And of course you can expect the usual games that release every year, like F124. I hope that we see something with my team, big improvements, big changes, because it has been the same for a couple of years. and we want something new. Also F1 Manager 24 is coming this year and it would be great if you can create your own team like my team but then as the manager of course so what else would you like to see in this game? MotoGP 24 is of course coming but also Japanese Drift Master so you can drift around in the OG Japanese cars they are just the best okay and maybe we'll see something of Forza Horizon 6 it's a great game one of my favorites really nice open world just more arcade but really enjoyable to play so hope to see more for that as well all right that's it make sure to like subscribe and comment if i missed anything or what game you're looking forward to in 2024 bye